Hi, and welcome to the TennisForums.com. This video will show how to create a local account when installing Windows 10. Boot your PC with the Windows Install Media, select your regional and keyboard settings and click Next. Click Install Now. Enter your product key and click Next. If installing without a key, click Skip and select the correct Windows edition. Accept the end user license terms and select Custom Install. Click Next if you don't need to partition your hard drive. In this example, I will divide the hard disk to two partitions. Windows will then automatically create a third one, a so-called system reserved partition. I format all the other partitions I have created but leave the system reserved and the one I will install Windows to unformatted. When done, I select the partition I want to install Windows to and click Next. Windows will now start the install process. Depending on your hardware, this phase will take anything from a few minutes up to 12 to 15 minutes. After a reboot or two, Windows will finally enter the last phase of the setup process. If you installed Windows without the product key, as I did in this example, the first dialog asks you to enter it. Again, you can select Do this later and enter the key when installation is finished. Now, select Express settings for fast setup with default settings or select Customize settings. When asked who owns this PC, select I do and click Next. Click Skip this step, enter your preferred local account username, password and the password hint and click Next. Windows will now finalize the installation, create your user account and boot you to the desktop. If you installed Windows without the product key, you need to enter it now before you can customize your settings. You can enter your product key and activate Windows from Settings app. Select Update and Security, then select Activation and select Change Product Key and enter the product key. Click Next. Windows is now activated.
more Windows 10 news, tips and tutorials at the10forums.com.